if we want to have x is from 0 to 40 and the 20th of them to be the center at 400 then I will need to have this somehow changed to 0 exactly for x20 and the way that I'm going to use and it, that it's going to solve the problem is if I write here x minus 20 so um, when x is a small number like 3 or 5 when we subtract 20 from it it's going to become something perhaps negative or if we are scared by negative numbers we can open the brackets open those brackets and we are going to have x multiplied by distance minus 20 multiplied by distance and if you prefer this is the way I will write it So let's see if this is really working. You can see that the squares were going to the left too. I'm going to delete some spamming console walks in order for the application to not be so slow. And let's see that now it's working fine. Yeah, it's working fine, but uh, I have to. Um, I'm seeing only squares down to the left and right, so I'm going to need the same change to the formula of y is two. Please do it, and then start thinking of another formula for color number or some interesting formula for cover number that is not going to depend on randoms choose each time on each step but instead a formula that is going to depend for example on x and y so that we can have not not so changing blinking colors but instead we are going to have the same Covers for each of the squares moving out through the whole of the time, so the covers are not going to change, but they are going to be different for each square for all of the time. Try to do it yourself. <laughs> 